Yo, welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's your boy Shaded Rich coming back to you guys live with a brand new GTA Online video. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the brand new event week for GTA Online and everything to come in GTA Online in the upcoming weeks. But yo, if you guys are brand new, make sure you subscribe with all notifications turned on, as well as dropping a like on today's video. As you all may know, I'm hosting a huge $8 million shark card giveaway for this week, and it will be ending pretty soon. So if you guys want to enter yourself into that giveaway, make sure you guys subscribe with all notifications turn on drop a like on the video comment the console you play on as well as your gamer tag and i would like for you guys to go ahead and let me know what your actual amount is in your gta online accounts that'll help me out with choosing the right person to actually win this giveaway so yeah man let me know how much money you currently have in gta online in the comment section below and good luck to everybody entering the eight million dollar shark card giveaway but yo we got a brand new week in gta online there's a whole lot of new things going on that i want you guys to know about man so in today's video we're going to talk about it we're also going to be talking about the future of gta online and a few things that are coming although the weeks have been pretty dull in gta online it seems like we've just been getting event week after event week there's a lot of stuff that's going to be coming to gta online that is going to spark a lot of you guys interest and i think you guys are really going to enjoy what they actually have to bring not to mention we are approaching spring and it is coming up in just a few days which means we should be hearing something about a spring dlc if they are deciding on doing one i'm going to speak more about that later on in today's video but the first thing that's happening this week man is two times money in rp on the arena war series i know a lot of people are not big fans of this but this was one of those spring dlcs that came out that a lot of people didn't enjoy but it is two times money in rp we also have two times money in rp on the rhino hunt and as well as i think the best thing to do the special vehicle work now i believe these are only special vehicle missions um you guys know the actual vehicles that came out with that dlc you guys can basically do the missions to unlock those vehicles to basically purchase them and you guys should be getting double money in rp on that and it is worth it guys they're very very easy missions all you simply have to do is just do the mission that goes along with the special vehicle and after you guys are completed with that you should be able to get a ton of money from doing so now the arena wars does make you a lot of money but it does cost you a lot of money as well to get into that but don't worry guys we're gonna be giving you guys the best techniques to actually make money in gta online in today's video and simple guys all you really have to do is the crate work uh back in the day when i was broke in gta online and i didn't really have a lot of money and i couldn't really buy vehicles or properties what i did was i sold all the cars that i had from my garage and i invested into a ceo business okay so i bought the ceo office and after i bought the ceo office i went ahead and just created a secure old serve after i did that i went ahead and just started to sell crates then i started to source vehicles and it kind of made me a lot of money now the cool thing about sourcing vehicles is it's unlimited you can source as many vehicles as you possibly want once you guys source those vehicles man just let them stack up till you get to like 100 vehicles and then you can go ahead and sell those vehicles for a ton of money yes it will take you a lot of time but i guarantee you guys it will be worth it all in the end and you'll have enough money to do things like the arena wars or pretty much anything that's double money in rp that you need a property for now the next thing i want to talk about is some free items in gta online we got a brand new heavy duty t-shirt i don't know how happy you guys are about this but it is free so when you log on you can get it we also have a brand new podium vehicle this week which is the common sr and it is going to be on the actual podium until the 24th of march so i know it may not be a car that you guys want it is a really cool car though it's been in the game for a very long time and i believe you can sell it if you actually don't want it but if you guys do win it like i said man if you don't want it just invest that money into something else in gta online to where you can actually buy a car that you actually like you know but yeah you guys have until march 24th to spin the wheel for that so i would just take full advantage of that if, especially if you're playing the game every day just walk into the casino spin the wheel and you will be all good to go now the next thing i want to talk about is some discounts we have 40 percent off on pretty much everything in the actual arena wars we also have 30 percent off on some more attachments to the vehicles we also have another 30 percent off on this vehicle 30 percent off on the death bike it's just so many discounts in gta online for arena wars and as you guys can see there's a whole bunch of arena vehicles that are actually discounted you could also get a free vertical jump added to any arena vehicle which is really cool we also have a few more discounts here if you guys want to buy any of these vehicles now like i said man the discounts are always going to come each week so if there's something that you really want i suggest just waiting to see if it does get discounted before the next dlc and speaking of dlcs guys we literally are in spring in the next few days which means we should be hearing something if we are going to be getting a brand new spring dlc now we haven't heard any leaks or rumors all that has been basically done is the qa 
gameplay beta testing now what really sucks though is the past few spring dlcs were kind of flop so i believe last year we had the uh open world racing the year before that was the arena wars the year before that i believe it was like uh, transform races and i don't remember what the year before that was but there hasn't really been a really good spring dlc that has come out and i'm hoping that rockstar kind of breaks that trend this year and i hope that they actually take full advantage of the next generation consoles and hopefully they put out their actual expanded and enhanced version a little earlier than planned now they don't have a release date for it they just told us that it would be coming later 2021 so that honestly could be right after march it could be literally in the summer it could be in the winter but we just know it's 2021 and the later version of 2021 so hopefully they are planning to do that but like i said we don't really know much about what's going to be going on in the spring i don't know if rockstar is planning to do something big i don't know if they're going to keep it small because they know that the next generation consoles are here and they're planning bigger things for that i don't know where their mindset is right now i know that they're not working from home anymore so hopefully we can get something pretty big but like i said man when arena wars came out in the beginning a lot of people didn't really enjoy it and still to this day a lot of people don't play arena wars like it's just one of those things that people don't do on gta online most people just focus on heist or focus on playing with their friends or just buying vehicles and customizing vehicles riding around the city a lot of people do most of the stuff that they like in free roam like but like i said guys we should be expecting something in the spring i mean i can see them doing something small i can't see them just not doing anything at all so i will keep you guys updated on the channel as we are approaching the spring of 2021 i'm just hoping that rockstar steps it up this year man they bring out some crazier dlcs the kyle perico heist was amazing but we all knew as soon as everybody got a chance to do the heist that the dlc would kind of just fade out and that's kind of what it's been doing so hopefully rockstar has something huge planned for spring and if they don't man i'm just really excited for the summer and we're not that far away i mean us content creators that make gta videos specifically gta news videos we all know that this is pretty much downtime for rockstar games and this is when they're actually preparing the bigger dlcs and developing them and this is their time frame to do so so even if we don't get something for the spring like i said the summer is going to be huge we're going to be receiving some crazy dlc and i'm already knowing that they're putting a lot of time and effort into it especially if we miss out on the spring this year but i want to know you guys thoughts and opinions do you guys like any of the discounts that are happening this week are you guys going to be purchasing anything let me know in the comment section down below i would really like to read you guys these comments and see what you guys are buying but yo if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure you smack a like on it if you want to stay up to date subscribe well all notifications turn on your boy shady rich is going to keep you guys locked into this gta news but with that being said it's been your boy shady rich I'm signing out peace